well. Comes it away. Robinson again looking for some outside or inside run. He found the best man in the team. The Aaron puts on the afterburners to 40. Didn't quite strike it the way he'd like. Betts is there. Pears. Oh, he pickpocketed him. Got rid of it. Down to Yaron again. Gets a really good look. Well done. Get excited about that, Chris Yaron. Damage forever then, Richo, are you? Oh, well, that's 20 years, years, obviously. Obvious, I would have thought, Bob. Kick into the square. has been marked by Hurley. Hurley with a little left foot snapper. Bombers respond to two from the Blues. Goddard gets it and goes. Hurley did the beautiful push off the body there to wait. And he's looking to play on as well. And that's a little bullet into Watson. Yeah, Jared Wake. He's just trying to play too far in front of Hurley then. Have a listen to that. They are the Carlton supporters giving it to Joe Watson. And I can guarantee you, BT, the Essendon supporters are doing the complete opposite. They are cheering for him. They are showing the support for their skipper, Joe Watson. I think that's what Essendon supporters have done right throughout. They love the players. They love the club. And they're showing their support for the captain. Bombers have got them outnumbered tonight. I think they're drowning out the Blues as Watson comes in. This will silence them. Joe Watson gets it for the Bombers. His plays on pops it to the top of the square and Hurley completely did his man McInnes. Watson off the front of the pack magnificently. Kicked his second. Blues Jim Clark. That's why the Carlton players have those on their arms. Yaron cleverly keeps it alive. Did really well. Menzel with a fast hand. Armfield can run all the way. Needs to kick it now. Went the underground ball. Betts. Drew Armfield to the footy with a magnetic type ball and it's all down to whether Armfield can kick this 48 metres. Good work, Eddie Betts. Some blaze away. Gives it off, lets it rip to in. He likes his work. He's kicked the goal. I don't think they've had an entry in the four, in the four and a half minutes no. we've played so far, the Bombers, Richo. No, they've got to make it count, the Blues. It's been all at this end. Yaron, quick snap, got it. Blues have kicked the first two of the third quarter. Now they've got some space and time. Yaron's got some wheels, we know about that. The drawing handball was impressive to Gibbs. Gibbs can go all the way. Two bounces. He can shape up now. 40, 30, 25, closing. Gibbs kicks the goal. Five in a row for the Blues. So he's got all the tricks. Yaron went without it, and then he got a clobbered head. I think it was an accidental one from Hocking, but he topped it right in the mush. Hocking apologising behind play now. Let's just have a look at this one again. Heath Hocking comes in. And, Ooh. well, oh uh, boy. Aaron forearm. From Heath Hocking. There's Jarrett going back for the footy. Oh, and no, and he's gone. Carlton by just five. There's still nine and three quarter minutes to go in this game. And they have kicked the last two goals of the game. The Bombers, his rider! Directly in front, 30 metres out. Nick goes, oh no. This, two hit the front. Rider from directly in front. Punt road end, there's the task. Bombers are in front. Can you believe it by a point? Plays on and goes wide to Gibbs. And Gibbs has taken the mark. Stop. Here is Gibbs. 35 to 40 metres out on a 45 degree angle there. To put the Blues in front, but he can only draw it. That is a huge miss. Hibbert free, the advantage played. Howlett, the Bombers can win this one. Bagley, Bagley a long ball. Tomlin looks behind him and says, someone do it. Boy, McInnes went for the spoil when he didn't need to. And then he ran over the top of his own man. Oh, boy, Sarakis kicks the goal. He's done it again. Sarakis has done it again with 28 seconds left. Boy, oh, boy, McInnes bowled his own mate over. Not once, but twice. What about this game? And the Bombers are going to win. The Bombers are going to win here today. James Hurd and his Bombers have won.